in a situation of fight or flight, I've always chosen fight. Unfortunately, in my younger years, I didn't have very good fighting weapons. Like anyone else, I used aggressive behavior, hurtful words, apathetic sarcasm. Didn't seem to get me anywhere. Some would say I had a bad attitude. Most people, though, simply didn't even notice I was there. Why? Because I acted just like everyone else. It made me invisible. Well, you know what? People get tired of feeling invisible. Why do you think so many people finally reach the end of their rope, cause a big scene just to get some attention? Sometimes sitting in tragedy, right? So we live in a time when people feel more lonely and invisible than ever. We desperately need a solution. Social media sure isn't getting the job done, am I right? Over the past decade, I've picked up a skill that has acted as both a fighting weapon and a means of staying visible. I call it Joy Kwon Do, because it truly is a martial art that uses the power of joy. With this skill under my belt, I've never felt more powerful and more visible in my life. When I'm faced with a fight situation, I fight back using my newfound weapons of confidence and a smile. Instead of getting my opponent to scream back at me, I get him to laugh. I've never seen anything work so quickly and effectively. And how does this joy make me less invisible? It's simple. People take notice when something's unusual. In any given situation, I refuse to respond the same way everyone else would. It's too predictable. Doing something completely different throws your audience off guard and draws them in.